welcome to a Wonky Beans Blind Bag Tutorial. You will need a glue stick, your favourite slime, some stuffing of your choice, some sellotape, some scissors, and some great colour pencils don't forget to pre-draw your pictures using a pencil first using a sharpie you're going to go around all the edges of your pencil of your drawing Wow, do you see how this drawing is coming together amazingly? I just love doing the eyes of this beautiful character. I love the little sun, it's absolutely amazing. Draw all the pictures out. It just makes it more easier. You're doing a fantastic job. Well done. Wow, this is looking amazing. I bet your pictures are fantastic too. And remember, you can use any character you would like. Now using an eraser, rub out all of your pencil lines. Please remember to use a sheet of paper underneath when you are using your Sharpie. And you don't want to get the table all messy. Now for the colours. Using your favourite colour pencils, colour in your pictures. It can be as sparkly and as beautiful as you like. Remember, it's your creation. And when it comes to art, there are no rules. So you can go ahead and colour absolutely any colour that you have or desire. Wow, this picture is really coming along. I just love the way the yellow shines. It's so beautiful, golden. I've used a deep orangey brown for the eyes to make those eyes just pop. Oh wow, look at this colour of yellow. It's absolutely beautiful, so vibrant, so bright. You are doing a fantastic job. Well done. You love them in every single way. So come and play with Flossies today. Flossies, Flossies, so fluffy too. Playing with them is 
And do exactly the same for your other drawings. And remember, there are no rules to which colours you use. You can just have fun and use any. I just use yellow because it is one of my favourite colours. Now we are ready for step two. Take a plain piece of paper and place it behind your picture. Taking some sellotape, we are going to seal the edges only. Remember to cut off the excess sellotape. Remember only do the three edges and leave an opening at the top. Or if you forgot to leave an opening, you can just simply snip it off with a pair of scissors. The next step, we are going to cut around our squishy. Remembering to cut the ears off. Now turn over your piece of paper and on the underside, glue and then stick. Proceed to cut out the ears and leave them aside. Any excess paper, don't waste it, just cut it off and you can use it again later. Now place the sellotape all the way around. All the way up we go, leaving a little room at the top. Now turn it over and do the same on the other side. We 
well done. You're doing such a great job. Wonderful time to share with everyone. Fluffies are the perfect little pets. A fluff if you find your salad tape keeps sticking to the table, then just simply use a chopping board, a plastic one. Proceed to cut the salad tape all about round, about leaving about one centimeter. Then it's time to stuff it. Now you want to make sure that you get it right into the cheeks to make that squishy nice and plump. Well done! You are following this tutorial amazingly. Now seal the top of your squishy keeping it in place and all the way around the top only place your sellotape. Well done! Now snip in all the way around this squishy not too close to the squishy though and now using the sellotape go all the way around the edges to seal your squishy into place and remember you can pause this at any time if it goes too fast now onto the ears using a bit of sellotape we are going to take the ears to our squishy. It takes a little practice, but you'll get there. Well done. Now on to the next part. We are going to simply cut out our pictures. Remember, no waste. just use a pair of scissors to go around the edge to neaten it up lastly seal up your envelope making sure you have room to place your card inside well done this is looking amazing now simply cut around a circle or any if you're using a square tub you can make it square and stick your sticker on and but down your blind bag is nearly finished placing all of your items inside of your blind bag and now seal it up with some sellotape at the top and there you have it all finished well done you did an amazing job and if you like this video and would love to see more please subscribe to wanky beans we would love to have you here and remember to leave a like and a comment and tell us about your favorite drawing bye for now